I want to thank Jackery for sponsoring this video. If you're looking for a way to charge and power your devices on your next outdoor adventure, give Jackery's line of portable power stations a look. I have personally been using the Jackery Explorer 240 and it has been doing a great job at powering my off-grid office and keeping my camera equipment charged and ready to go. For a more in-depth look at the Jackery Explorer 240, check out the link at the end of this video. starting to get up here this morning uh, we're camped up in a uh, campground just outside of the Hell's Canyon National uh, Wilderness I'm up here with my buddy Matt and uh, we usually we do this every year we come up into this area every year but unfortunately this year uh, we haven't really been able to get into some of the areas that we normally like to go into because we're kind of hemmed in by snow uh, the light snowstorm even affected this area and uh, it, a lot of the a lot of the roads that we access to get up high in the mountains are still well blocked with snow and we can't get up there but uh, there's another area that uh, there's a hiking trail that I've never hiked before and I want to kind of check that out so I thought that would be our plan for today is I'd grab the dogs in a backpack and uh, we'll go ahead that hiking trail and see how far up into the hills we can get up that way enjoying a little breakfast and coffee on a beautiful day it uh, looks like it's gonna be really gorgeous today the sun's out uh, coming down into the camp now things are finally starting to warm up a little bit it was actually fairly chilly this morning when the Sun first started to rise but I'm not in any really hurry I'm not, I am gonna go hiking today but I'm looking kind of hike more in the afternoon I'd like to be up in an area maybe to be able to shoot more of a sunset photo or late afternoon photo so I'm just you know kind of enjoying myself you know like I said eating some breakfast and coffee and not moving real fast uh, I'm enjoying the fire here that I got with my little uh, solo stove got you guys had a lot of questions about this in one of my last videos I will be doing a review on it so if you do have questions about it I'll be looking at the ones from the last video but also if you um, or just seeing it now and you have questions about the solo stove uh, leave those in the comments below and I'll make sure to um, address those in the review so kind of look forward to that and probably the next three to four weeks uh, we'll we'll get a good review out on it so but like I said I'm just gonna finish eating breakfast uh, we'll probably pack up our gear and start moving out of here in the next hour or two and uh, head up to the trailhead and go do some hiking this afternoon
right, so uh, we're getting all packed up. It's getting about late morning. Uh, so I figure we'll go ahead and get loaded up and we'll get heading to the trail and that should give us plenty of time to kind of get hack, hike back in there a ways before uh, the late afternoon sun starts to hit the canyon, which should make for some decent landscape photography. So we're gonna hop in and get rolling. I'm just getting my pack out and stuff. We're at the trailhead. Uh, forest service signs and everything look like they're pretty well faded. This is a pretty popular trailhead in this area. Uh, a lot of stock outfitters come in here. Uh, they'll haul people up into the wilderness, go bear hunting or other hunters with horses will go up and they'll create base camps up in the wilderness and, and hunt from there. Right now it is spring bear season and that's why there is some stock trailers uh, in the area. So I imagine that we will uh, could very possibly find some uh, some horse camps and stuff out in the wilderness as we go back in there a ways. Uh, for me, I'm hoping to be able to kind of just get up and you know check out some of this area. I've looked at it lots of times on maps and I've always been real interested in taking a look at it. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna grab the dogs, load up the pack and, and uh, head a few miles back in and see what we can find. Stop so gonna get on the ride Twisting and turning through life No matter how rough it gets I'll get by Home moves with me where I roam It's in every dream I make my own I'm never alone I know that every day will always bring me something new Every day will bring me something new All right, so we just stopped here for a minute to take a quick break. Uh, admittedly, the dogs and I are not in the best shape that we've probably ever been in. Uh, we've gotten a little lazy since Wheeler's surgery and all the uh, winter storms that we had and everything that there hasn't been a whole lot of hiking going on. But we've been slowly but surely kind of getting back in the shape. But uh, this is a pretty good, pretty good haul on this trail. It's a lot of steep country. So I just want to make sure I'm not overworking the dogs or myself. So we're just, you know, going to stop here and there. Uh, this is a good place because there's a good creek. They can get plenty of water and then I'll give them a good rest before we uh, continue hiking on. I think we got as far as we're gonna go on this trail. Uh, it's already about four o'clock. <clears throat> We've been humping it up this hill for quite a ways and it looks like we're just gonna to continue to be stuck in all this forest. And I was really hoping that we'd get out on maybe one of these bald hills uh, like you see behind me and I'd open up and I'd have a really grand landscape uh, to shoot a photo of. But like I said, it looks like we're just gonna continue on. Uh, I put the drone up in the air in fact and it looks like this is just gonna be forest down this trail for quite some time. So, uh, like I said, it's four o'clock. The dogs are starting to get looking like they're getting pretty tired. Uh, I'm getting pretty tired. So I think what we'll do is we'll just call it. We'll start to head back down the trail. We'll get back to camp and see what Matt's up to.
So what'd you do today? Turkey hunt. Did you get anything? I did. I did. Uh, got a nice, got a nice tom. Yeah. First one ever. It's pretty good. <laughs> I was excited. Yeah. No, that's awesome. I was excited when I got back and saw and saw the fan and the and the um, legs there. That's awesome. So take some meat back to the family. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Breasted it out. Got the legs. So yeah. Awesome. Yeah, I hiked that trail over there at, um, I hiked that trail over there at Freeze Out. Uh, two trails, I apparently took the long one that just led into a bunch of forest. It was a beautiful hike, absolutely, absolutely gorgeous country. Didn't really find anything I wanted to sh shoot in the way of a real photo. I mean, I shot a lot of, you know, just kind of snapshots, but, and I uh, had a great time with the dogs. Dogs did great. That was a that was a big hike for them. We've been doing some small hikes here, but that was probably the biggest we've done since Wheeler had his surgery, so. Yeah, that's pretty good, especially how old uh, Wheeler's getting. Well, yeah. both of them, yeah. 13? Yeah. yeah, both of them are, Wheeler's definitely 13. Daisy's very close to being 13. Um, yeah, so, no, both of them did fantastic. They're both sacked out in the tent now, though. They had a, that was a big day for them. They're sacked out now. And uh, I gave them a double portion of food and, and uh, they went to bed, but anyhow, I'm I'm pretty beat too. I tell you what, that was a lot of hiking. I haven't even done much hiking since Wheeler's been down, so I'm pretty beat too. So I think uh, think I'm going to have a little bit more Pendleton here with you in this fire, and uh, we'll call it a call it a day. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, yeah, it was a good time. Yeah, we couldn't get into a lot of the locations that we that we normally get into, but. I think we still, I think we learned a lot more about this location than what we had known previous about it. So it was still a good trip. A lot. And uh, I'll look forward to coming back next year. So. Yeah, absolutely. Hope All righty. Bear tag. Yeah. <laughs> All righty, guys. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like. Uh, if you're not subscribed to my channel and you enjoy these camping uh, photography style videos, uh, please subscribe and I'll catch you guys again outside. All right, man. Well, what have you been doing all day? Turkey hunting. Yeah, and you had a little success today, huh? I did. You did. Well, that's better I than I did. I hiked and hiked that trail, <laughs> but uh, but uh, I didn't really get anywhere that I really wanted to be. But that's uh, awesome that you got a turkey. Is that your first turkey? It is. Yeah, it's my first one. First anything, really. Talk to the camera. We got a little bitch. <laughs>